Now, if y'all coming to pay rent, y'all can slide. See, when I ain't had no money, I still had sauce. Mm -hmm. See, if you don't got no sauce, then you get lost. Mm -hmm. But you can also get lost in the sauce. You can get lost. How you get lost in the sauce? Uh, a bitch, man. A bitch gonna get lost in the sauce, man. Mm -hmm. So I'm back at the house. It's like probably nine something. Now I'm finally going to officially put the stuff in my fridge. I figured out how to turn it on. It's nice and cool. I got some of my skincare here. This is not even half of my skincare. Um, but this is just what I'm gonna put in there for right now. So I'm gonna show you guys. Just a slight half vanity tour. Mind you, I'm going to be doing a full apartment tour as soon as I get everything together, y'all. But this is basically how the left side of my vanity is going to look. So I think I'm going to keep some makeup remover wipes over here. These are my current favorite. Um, I love St. Ives. I know the skin community on YouTube says no, but bitch, my skin says yes. And these wipes are really, really great. They're great for removing tons of cakey makeup, but it's not too harsh for my really sensitive skin. So I love these. And they don't have like a really strong fragrance either. So I like that. I just have my tools kind of up here. Mask applicator rolling under eye. I just tried it and y'all, it really works and really, really quick. So if you thought about investing in one, try it, sis. I got this mask here from Dollar Tree. It's just a gel mask that I honestly could probably use on a daily basis for like a booster. I got a clay mask down there. Again, most of my masks are still at my mom's house, so I still have to move a lot of my favorites over. But I do have some rosehip oil back there, and then this is just an aromatherapy oil. And then I do have some of my go-to face mask, and then I have a mask applicator down there as well um glasses i just have my rings right here y'all how cute is this ring i wanted to show you guys once hold up can i put it on let's see i wanted to show you guys this ring once my nails were done but i bought this ring when christian and i first started dating like back in february y'all why i just arrived the other day so aliexpress is taking a long ass time to like deliver things because of corona but if you're waiting on a package, it will arrive. Just be patient. I also ordered this one too. It's like an accent gold ring. I really like it. I think this set's cool. Especially when my nails are done. Over here, this was in my old bathroom. I know the golds are clashing. But I think the theme that I want for my house is to be like mixed metal. So I like the copper, the bronze, the rose gold. I like it all. We'll see. We'll see. Um, I have some more oils here. Um. And then I just have some lotions. So I do plan on making this like my smell goods corner again. So I guess I could put a perfume back here. Um, but yeah, I don't know, child. I, I don't know. So my nieces and Whitney left. I don't even know if I vlogged, but I kind of just got off work like 30 minutes ago. And I actually have had an annoying day annoying ass day um i was supposed to you guys can see my clothing racks over there it was about to start probably gonna start at like two o'clock in the morning don't ask me why um my tire delivered so i have an appointment eight o'clock in the morning to go get my tire put on my car then the internet people are supposed to arrive and drop off that then i'm just planning on fucking relaxing and then i have another i have to go to work at 11 and that's that's all 
really. I have decided to take a break on my classes. Um, and I'm glad because y'all I've been doing too fucking much. I got a D in my class. I don't care. Um, but I moved. I got this job. My body is literally, my neck is still tense. Everything still hurts. I ordered some really good Chinese sushi back there. So I'm probably about to eat, relax, and... do something i don't know how i feel about my hair i like it but they are huge and it's kind of heavy slowly but surely guys i'll try to film in the morning because i know i ain't doing shit else tonight and honestly i'm not in the best of mood i don't want to film when i'm in a bad mood so i want to wash some laundry now that i have my clothes set up my microwave came in and so yeah i put up some stuff my sister rinsed off my dishes I cut up some watermelon, so I have watermelon in the fridge. Um, but yeah, y'all. This is where the bees were starting fucking, trying to make a house out of my lantern. They ain't have it up for like three days, and they already... And I should have known better, because my house is too close to this lake for me to be attracting animals. So I need to be mindful of that. What's up, y'all? I hope I don't get demonetized. Oh, let me turn this fucking music up. I don't have time. Okay, Google, pause the music. I'm about to, I'm about to vlog right quick, so just wait, okay? But I'm the windows open, but hey, y'all. I got conditioner on my hair right now. I don't know what I want to do with it, so I'm going to just let my hair do its thing until I can decide. But yeah, I've just been putting my room together slowly but surely. This is not how my bed is going to look, but this is how it looks for the temporary move-in. And I got things coming together mind y'all i'm gonna do an actual house tour eventually but um i'll just 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 show y'all bathroom so honestly my bathroom's like the most put together i think i don't know all my products are down here neil i did this earlier and i'm still adding products got my hot tools over there and whatnot so i got my skin routine coming together i look real lazy but i literally just got out the shower my hair still wet i'm about to go to target it's my first day off in six days, okay? So I just bought me a dresser for my room. I'm slowly but surely buying furniture. I'm about to go to Target to get a little bit of things that I need. Here's the shower. Don't mind the shower because I was just in it. But um, yeah, I got some more products up here. I still need a shower curtain. I got the clear one, but there's Imani for everybody wondering. I put her in the bathroom. Um, and then, yeah, I don't have anything in here yet, so, <laughs> yeah. My TV came. I got this TV. It's a 43-inch, um, and I got this TV from Best Buy. Finally got Wi-Fi. I actually have cable. I just haven't hooked this up because my dad's going to come and mount the TV. Um, there's a peek of the kitchen. I ain't going to show you guys in there yet, though. And then I just have my art up, and I put my art up by myself. I'm so happy. Here's my view. You guys really liked my view and I like it too. Probably gonna sit out here later on. Um, but yeah, y'all, I bought this lantern and can y'all help me out? I bought this lantern, it's not a real candle, candle or anything like that, but I had it hanging up here, which is really cute at night. But the next two days, the next two days that I was on my balcony, I couldn't even come out here because my balcony is screened in, but of course animals find oasis. <laughs> they always find a way. There's a crack somewhere. I know, it's an old apartment. But when I lit the candle and I accidentally left the lantern lit at night, the next day, baby, I had big horse flies, big wasps, big roaches, just everything. And you know I live by a lake, so the insects was really attracted to this lantern. So I wanted to hang it up. I do because it's cute. I don't have time for the animals. So my sister was telling me there's some, like, lantern or something. Some I don't know. What can I do and put it on my porch to keep the critters wet? Okay, because they don't belong here. They don't pay rent. Now, if y'all come to pay rent, y'all can slide. Yeah, y'all. I'm proud of myself. I'm going to sit down probably tonight and record. I always say that. L I, lately, I've been feeling like my hair has to be done and stuff. So tomorrow, when my wash and go dries, this ain't a wash and go yet, but it will be. When my wash and go dries, I will do um a video. Y'all look so crazy. I know... Today is Tuesday and I'm working right now. I'm actually on a little break. So I'm trying to vlog. I got the house coming together, y'all. But I just got a package from Bath and Body Works. 
not sponsored, but this shit sponsors you, girl. Because now that I'm in my adulting gang, and excuse me, I know my AC loud as fuck. But now that I'm in my adulting gang, y'all, I really like these home purchases. Like, this has been fun. It's been a little overwhelming because I was just telling my boyfriend I want this place to come together and be homey because there's still, still no couch. But everything else is coming together. Like, everything is looking, it's looking really good. Anyway, I wanted to show you guys my mini haul, my mini purchase that I got from Bath and Body Works before the freaking sale came out. I'm stretching my hair right now, so don't look at me crazy, but my hair actually is really cute. My wash and goes are getting way good. That I got, I really like hand soap. Anyway, I've been getting everything together and I really just want nice soaps. I wash my hands a lot. Corona's still here. Soap, wash your hands. So I got this aromatherapy soap that I've been using. This is gonna sit in the kitchen for now. Um, I didn't even know aromatherapy had effing soaps. Um, this one is the energy. And I feel like when I wake up in the morning or when I come make my breakfast or anytime I want to eat, just getting a push of energy is awesome. So really quick while it's here, I got these really small candles. First of all, I didn't know these were the single wick candles from Bath & Body Works. I usually get the three wick, clearly. Maybe this is small as hell. These are like my decor candles right there. So... I'm going to stick with getting my three wicks. These are cute, but these ain't going to do nothing. Like, I'm going to burn these. This is another aromatherapy, though. This is a relax. I love this scent. So I just got this to go in the living room. Um, as I'm working throughout the day, that can be lighting and, you know, smelling good in the house. Get some relaxation. Because, child, working from home, y'all should know by now. If you don't know, <laughs> thanks to Rona, now y'all know. All right, so this is the champagne toast. It's going in the bathroom right now. It still has some plastic on here, but I'll get that off later. Bomb. Of course, I've already used um, the, like the body smells, and I think this had a candle too that I liked, but I've never actually used the soap, and the soap, the smell is just like so strong. I don't know. I love this scent, so I got that. I love White Barn even more. If I had to choose like a line by Bath & Body Works, White Barn is my favorite, and then a little aromatherapy, and then the others. But anyway, I got this one. It's the Mango... Uh, I don't know how to say that, so I'm not even going to try, but is it my tie? I don't know. I think this is really, really, really cute design. I got this Georgia Peach because she's one of my favorite, and she, I am a Georgia Peach. Love that, love that. And then, shout out to Bath & Body Works. I wanted to try their Wild Lavender Mint. With depression, lavender is like a really good smell or scent to help with like your emotions and balance, you know, anxiety and things like that. But I really just like that lavender and mint are my favorite scents and I really just wanted to try this. And they sent two because after I placed the order, I asked my mom, I was like, dang, I should have got you one. And she was like, well, just let me steal your lavender one. And baby, they sent two. So shout out to y'all. Now I can give my mom one and still have one to try out. So I'm really excited about that. I got all my soaps. I also got one more candle. So yeah, y'all, I got one more candle, and it's actually lighting already. This is the Champagne Toast candle. So I actually got the, and y'all don't mind my antidepressants back there. <laughs> but yeah, this is um the candle to the soap that I bought. Everybody always asks what I film with. This is the Sony A3600. But yeah, so I love that. I'm definitely probably going to repurchase, though, the three wick candles, because the small ones are not going to last me long. But they're definitely cute. Perfect. Yes. Yes. Who knew candle holders are really cute holding candles? Y'all, I'm so mad at myself right now. I'm trying not to be a bum. I was doing good. It's three o'clock. I've been productive all day. And I'm literally this fucking close to finishing a video for tomorrow, y'all. On schedule. And I deleted the whole fucking thing. Like, the whole thing. The only thing I had left to do was add the music. And now I gotta restart. Luckily, it's not a hard video, but that shit is bumming me out right now. So, I'm on lunch. I'm about to go and check um, my video. I'm, I can't even fucking think. I'm on lunch. I'm about to go check my mail. Don't do this. Just look, it's okay. It's okay. Girl, I'm at work right now. I don't even feel like working no more. Like, I'm honestly over it. That should be proud of me. I've been wearing my hair for like almost a week. And the curls still look good, in my opinion. Um. So, yeah. 
I guess I'll moisturize it today. I've been moisturizing my hair every other day. But all right, let me hurry up because I only got a 30 minute lunch. And we're getting there. Saturday, I want to put my wig back on. So my hair's going to go away. But I am glad that I was able to wear it for a week or so. I think every four or three weeks, I'm going to alternate and wear my hair. Because I don't wear my hair at all throughout the year. And it needs to start getting trained for me to wear it out. So, yes. Y'all, so today is Friday, it's payday, it's Juneteenth, happy Juneteenth. I don't even know if I was recording or not, but I'm on my way back to the fucking hair store to get another ponytail because I just fucked it up. My hair looked good, everything looks great, but I couldn't get the ponytail on and look how I wanted it to because my hair was curly and as you can tell, I'm kind of aggravated right now. I literally just got off work and everyone keeps blowing up my phone. I don't feel like talking. I just haven't had a break. Like, I want to sit down and just relax and enjoy airing time. I've been trying to work and do YouTube. And now everybody wants me to do some shit for them. But I'm, I'm tired. It's raining. It's time to relax. It's time to chill. At least I uploaded today. Like I said, my hair 